And he told them a parable to the effect that they ought always to pray and not lose heart. Luke 18, verse 1. On Sunday night, I was doing a Bible study on prayer with the young adults. We talked about how there are times where God says no to our prayer requests, and when that happens, it's okay to stop that particular line of praying. However, there are also times when God does not say no, and the encouragement we receive from this verse and other biblical examples is that we should be persistent. Shortly after everyone left the house, I received a text from my brother-in-law with a link to a video capturing the ceremony by which his son was chrismated into and made a member of the Holy Orthodox Church. I could hardly believe what I was watching. Kathy, I, and many others have been praying for years that God would draw Tim, our nephew, to himself and place people in his life that could be influential in him returning to the faith that he had been baptized into but had drifted far from. I look forward to hearing the story of Tim's journey, but for now, I rejoice with all the angels of heaven that prayers have been answered and that Tim is walking afresh with the Lord. Perhaps you have been praying for someone to come to faith and have been tempted to give up. Perhaps you've been praying about a situation and have seen little change even though you continue to lift it up in prayer. Jesus' parable and Tim's testimony are reminders of the importance of always praying and not losing heart. May God help you to hang in there in your prayers for people and for situations. Press on in the Lord.